I'm just about to reveal how you can make money on Amazon by selling books through Amazon KDP, so let's get started. Now, KDP stands for Kindle Direct Publishing, and this is where you get to self-publish ebooks that will reach millions of readers on Amazon. In other words, just to give you guys a little bit of perspective, publishing takes less than five minutes and your books will appear on Kindle stores all over the world within 72 hours. So that is pretty fast. You get to earn up to 70% royalty on your sales and you're always in control. That sounds pretty good. And to be honest, selling on Amazon KDB is not that difficult. I think that anyone can do it. The difficult part is actually getting sales and making money so that it's worth your time. So here's what most people don't understand about Amazon KDP. When you think about selling books through Kindle Direct Publishing, you're probably thinking about novels. And that is true, you can actually sell novels on Amazon and create them through Amazon KDP. It is possible. But if you choose that niche, you're literally competing against established authors that have hundreds of thousands of sales and have been in the business for decades. Decades. Guys, if you search for Kindle books on Amazon, you're gonna have to compete against Prince Harry. This is not gonna be too easy. And that's why we're gonna be focusing on different types of books. So how about this? Low content books. Now, if you're not familiar with the concept, let me briefly explain how it works. You see, a low content book has minimal or no content whatsoever on the interior pages. And so the pages are generally repetitive and designed to be filled by the user. We're talking about notebooks, planners, journals, and any other similar work. And creating one such book is actually easier than you might think. First off, you need to go over to your bookshelf. Then you will have the option to choose between a paperback and a hardcover. This is where you get to enter your information. Once you're done with that, and you have uploaded your content, such as the print options, and you're also done with the pricing, you get to publish your paperback or hardcover book and you're good to go. However, I want this video to be 100% truthful and honest. And for that reason, I wanna show you something. If you search for a journal on Amazon, you're gonna have a little bit over 80,000 results. So if you're a new seller, if you're planning to sell a journal through Amazon KDP, you're gonna have to compete against 80,000 other sellers. And to be honest, some of their products look very, very good. We have various sellers here getting thousands upon thousands of sales. So your chances of standing out from the crowd here are slim to none, to be honest. And this right here is where branding comes into play. My personal opinion is that if you're planning to launch a journal through Amazon KDP and sell it on Amazon, your chances of success are very, very slim. However, if you wanna go the extra mile, do a little bit of work and create a brand around your product, then you can definitely pull this off and make a lot of money. Just like this seller did right here. They have over 4,500 ratings, and keep in mind that not each customer will leave a review and they're selling this at $12 a piece. Let's just do the math. Guys, that's over $54,000 generated by this seller with a journal. But the reason why they were so successful is the branding. This is not just a journal. This is a self-care journal, a day and night reflection journal. In other words, it's a personalized one. It has something to make it stand out from the crowd. It has something unique. And so each and every single one of the interior pages will actually have a specific purpose. Instead of just being empty and allowing you to fill it out, it does have a bunch of different sections here. What I ate for breakfast, number of cups of water I drank. There is an audience for that. And guys, let's be honest here. Making over $50,000 with a journal on Amazon, that sounds pretty good. You only need to create it once, you're not even gonna have to worry about manufacturing it because you're gonna do that through Amazon KDP and you're good to go. This is basically passive income if you think about it. And the best part is that this is not the only example. If we take another minute to scroll through the results, you're gonna notice a bunch of other planners and journals that also have thousands of views. And each and every single time, you're gonna notice they have one thing in common. All of them are branded. Look at this one, burn after writing. Guys, I'm not kidding, this is a journal that is supposed to be burned after you write on it. And obviously, this is a pretty unique concept. That is why I was able to sell over 82,000 different copies, at least, at $7 a piece. Now let's do the math. Guys, that's over $618,000. So if you were questioning whether or not you can actually make money on Amazon by selling planners and journals, it is pretty obvious to me that you can. All it takes is one good idea. Combine that with a pretty good branding 
and you're good to go. You just got yourself a bestseller. And obviously, there are a bunch of other things you can do to maximize your chances. Another example that comes to mind is the finisher's secrets right here. Just like the other journal we have reviewed a few minutes ago that was all about self-care, this one also has a very specific target audience and it is dedicated to entrepreneurs and high achievers who want to get as much done as possible. They want to be very productive. So have a look at this. This is the number one journal for entrepreneurs. Again, it's a branded product. It looks great. It has a pretty cool design, but most importantly, it does have some functionality. It will allow you to plan out your days in advance in a very structured manner so that you can always stay on top of things. And they've also done a great job marketing their product as the better alternative. They actually have a huge social media presence as well. I mean, look at this, 246,000 followers on their Instagram account, and they've been doing a lot of influencer marketing, which means they were just reaching out to major Instagram pages, paying them a certain amount of money for a feature, and these pages would simply shout them out to their followers. This is how they built their audience, and they've done a pretty good job. That just goes to show that your marketing can definitely go beyond Amazon. Amazon is just the place where you're selling the products, but you can actually build additional streams of traffic by leveraging social media. We're talking about TikTok, Instagram, YouTube, you name it. Ultimately, if you're planning on selling low content books, I still think it is a good idea, but only if it comes with very good branding and you go the extra mile to actually create the brand around your product and make it unique and special and also add some functionality to it. Don't just sell a basic journal. It's not gonna work. But guys, there's more to it than that. We've talked about novels, we've talked about journals and planners, but things can get even more interesting than that. If you happen to be passionate about cooking, you can sell recipe books. Or if you're a good storyteller, you may wanna put together children's books. Or here's one of my actual favorites, coloring books. And no, these are not for kids. Guys, let me just copy that and paste it in a new Amazon tab here. Let me search for it. Once again, the competition will be pretty high. We've got a bunch of search results. But the thing is, not all of these are meant for children. And that is just insane to me. But it goes to show that anything can be sold with proper branding. Look at this one. This is a motivational coloring book for adults. I didn't know that was a thing. It came as a little bit of surprise to me as well but it's got over 12,000 ratings selling at $5 a piece. So that's over $60,000 in revenue. Now, Amazon also takes a cut. You got to account for that as well. But all in all, this is a success. Now look at this. This is what the interior pages look like. I'm not going to read that aloud for obvious reasons, but you got it. And this is not an isolated case either. Now, most of the coloring books will be targeted at kids. This one is a mindfulness coloring book. The concepts here are getting pretty crazy. Look at this. Here's what the interior pages look like. And so the opportunities are literally endless. What is for sure is that Amazon.com provides you with the infrastructure you need to create your product and sell it and reach millions of readers on their platform. All that is left for you to do is just come up with a unique idea and make it work. Then obviously you can reinvest your profits, you can create a major brand around your product, you can use social media platforms to really increase your exposure and raise more awareness about your product. There are so many things you can do, but it all starts with a good idea and good execution as well. Now, if none of these options sound good to you, you might also want to be focusing on comic books or put together some poetry, textbooks, or even book series. Again, these are just some of the options. And before you get started, make sure to spend a little bit of time doing some competition research and understanding what works in your niche. But guys, you have everything you need to make this work. That's it for now, and thanks for watching.